Optics by itself often is not the star technology. It's an enabling technology. It's a technology or a technique that allows you to do other things. Um, and there's a couple of really great examples of that, one of which is fiber optic communications. Okay, let's face it, the internet. The internet exists because of optics. Now, it's not the only technology necessary for the internet, but the thing that's connecting all the cities and all the computers is fiber optics, which is um, a, a very thin piece of glass that allows light to propagate down the length of the fiber and the light is modulated or turned on and off very quickly at one end and you can detect those signals at the other end. Of course the signal propagates at, guess what, the speed of light. Um, so you get very fast and very high capacity signals. And you can increase the capacity because you can send multiple colors down, uh, multiple wavelengths down the fiber and you have multiple channels. So optics really is an inherently an enabler of the internet. Without optics, the internet would be very different than what we have today. Um, another case where optics is truly an enabler is a field called microlithography. And microlithography is the printing process used to create integrated circuits, computer chips, memory chips. So without optics, without this field of microlithography, um, we wouldn't have computers, or they would look very different than what we have today. Uh, by the way, microlithography, if, you, if you're not familiar with that, isn't a whole lot different than a slide projector, um, where the pattern you want to write on the chip is placed on a mask or a slide, and then that slide is projected or imaged um, onto the pieces, onto the silicon wafer. You, and that enables the, the patterning of the integrated circuit to be, to be written. So once again, there's a technology that when you buy a computer, you don't think about the fact that there was an immense amount of optics that went into that computer because those optics aren't in the computer. They're back at the manufacturing plant.